Yo, what's up, boys? I'm gonna hit up some threes again with my boy Moses. Also with Apollo, he's another pro player. I don't know if he um if when he changes his name, he wants people to know who he is. So I'm not gonna tell you guys who he is. I'm actually glad we found the queue. Oh, we found a game too. We actually found everyone. Yeah, yeah. Now that's some good timing right there. Vince J. Wismod and hmm. This could be a decent game, I guess. I guess we'll see. Let's see. I see Moses up there, so I'm gonna wait back a little bit farther. Now that the ball's coming to the wall, I was gonna challenge it if it went low, but he went high, so I'm just gonna come back to goal again. He should be able to get a good clear here, so I'm just gonna wait up for the redirect. I didn't see Vince there. He cut me off pretty well. Let's see. I was hoping that ball went a little bit farther mid. Or not farther mid, but like farther towards their side, so I could get a better touch. I ended up missing the ball completely, but it didn't really matter too much. I can't get another touch there to hit it out. Um, looks like everyone's missing. Not sure why. See, Moses gets flicked, but because he made them flick it, I was able to challenge really easily and get a touch. So I'm going to wait on wall again. He goes up the wall and I try to pre-jump him. Almost got a shot off of it. If I got a shot, they wouldn't have really been able to save it. I went for the bump there on my way out. If I didn't get the bump, like Vince would have been able to stay in goal a little bit better. Because I bumped him out of goal, he couldn't recover at all to get to that shot. Make my boy Moss Man go for that kickoff. Oh, he actually might beat me to the side to change and go for a block at the end. Luckily I was still on track to hit the ball though. A lot of the time when people go for blocks, they just completely forget about hitting the ball in case they miss. Well, I do it as well sometimes, but that time I was still on track to hit the ball and get a block. I didn't go for a touch earlier there, I was just hoping that he would whiff or have a bad touch that I could play off of. I hit it up to Moses. If Moses doesn't do anything, I could have went on that as well, but I was low on boots. So I was just kind of moral support for him in that play. Yeah, I was waiting. I was like in position to get on the wall in case the ball went over my teammate there. So yeah, I'm gonna stay back. I think one of them are gonna go back for boost. Okay, I have no idea what he went for. It's working though. See, I'm gonna pre-jump Moses. Oh, I didn't see Vince at all. I was hoping that nobody was challenging early. Just give him the space. I like pre-jumping Moses. It works out sometimes. No clue why, but... Oh, that's a good boom by him. He's gonna follow it, but I'm gonna stay mid just in case. Oh, he hits it wide on accident. That's all fine though. Oh, I didn't see Apollo going in. I could have waited back there for sure. Oh, he went for the early read. That's fine though. I see that he's going back for boost too, so I'm gonna turn in like early. There's no saving that one. I couldn't have got back in time. Kind of an unfortunate kill by Moses. He didn't really mean to kill it, and then because he did, he couldn't really play off the ball that well. See, I just boom it across. I know that he was getting the mid boost, so there's no reason not to. My shot would have been much weaker than his could have been. So I'm kind of far, so I'm not going to go up for this. I'm going to let my two teammates play it. It allowed both my teammates to go up as far as they wanted. Like, I was so far back that they both could have gone for the ball, and it wouldn't have really mattered. I've already asserted my dominance. Apollo will go. Yeah, yeah. See. That was a decent touch. I'm gonna play it to the side, try to get Moses to get a touch on it. Oh, unfortunately, it was a little bit too high for him. I rushed that just to keep a little bit of pressure on their side of the field. Uh, there's a pretty good chance that Moses was going out, so I just kind of tried to turn the goal there. The ball was far enough away that even if the other team got a shot because no one committed to it, it wouldn't have mattered. Someone would have been able to save it. Yeah, I, get, I try to play that middle. Everyone's a bit far right now, though. I've been trying to keep boost control while I'm going up this game as well. Uh, boost and bumps are really good in three threes. They're good in twos as well, but they're a lot less necessary. I barely get beat to the ball again. I waited a little bit too long there. So I was going to try to go for a shot on goal, instead of just beating them. 
hopefully someone will go middle. I try to pop it up for them. Okay. It was a little bit too high for, for Moses there. Yeah, Apollo was going to challenge, so I had time to get boost, and then I could go off whatever he got. Oh, Moses boomed that, actually. Oh, I didn't mean to get a touch there. I wanted to leave it, and someone... Moses was following, so he could have got a shot. I was going in for a bump instead, and the ball just went into my path. Oh, we both went for the ball. No one went, though. I was just able to get a clean win. I was popping it, hoping that they could, that uh, Apollo would be able to beat the other team to the ball. I popped there again. Moses was waiting for me to pop, just because we played together so much, he knew that I'd do something like that. I'm gonna stay in goal. Vince might have bumped me there, so I went all the way back, just to dodge the bump in case he went for it. Moses seems to have control. I'm gonna go ahead and go up for boost. Then if they end up hitting it across, I'll be there anyway. Me and Moses both were there. It's fine. That's a good 50-50 to win. I was going to put the ball on their side and they have so little time to do anything. I'm able to get an easy kill on the ball. Holy shit, I have no awards. I'm, I'm useless. I was actually useless that game. Oh, we pop back into game two now. We got a West Virtual server. Oh, it wasn't virtual. I just can't read. We also didn't queue in all the way. Two people are reserved on... Oh. Well, I had high hopes and we got crushed. Alright, maybe this time. Maybe this time we'll actually get into the game. No reserved players. Hopefully. I think Dirty Dan was in one of the lobbies earlier that was reserved. Alright. I guess Apollo doesn't care about his name anymore. It was Timmy. Timmy's been unmasked. It's all good, though. I should be able to beat them to that ball. I played it off the ceiling hoping that I could get a second touch to myself. As long... Oh, I did not see that guy at all. I thought it was completely open at that point. That's why I waited so long. I was going to say as long as I don't bean it, this is an easy goal, but... Oh damn. I thought it was bouncing in mid some. So I was just cheating middle in the air. Waiting for the bounce. I completely misread it. And Timmy should be able to challenge that. I just played to the side hoping that he can get a decent touch. He actually booms the ball, I didn't think he'd get that much power on it. He lost that 50-50 though, so I'm going to start coming back. Moses is probably going to challenge. Yeah, he wins the challenge as well, so nothing important about positioning there. See, Moses is going to touch it again. I'm going to go ahead and take boost and go for bumps. Okay, there's no one to bump. Most of the time someone would be in goal there, so I could have bumped and then if they weren't expecting it, then Moses might have had an open goal there. I'm gonna sit in goal, Timmy might end up challenging now. I had to wait for what Dirty Dan was doing. If he touched the ball again on the wall, I would have had to do something differently. That was a really bad flick. I was trying to get power on it and I just kind of tickled the ball. <laughs> Feels bad. Yeah, it's gonna come out, so I can play it out myself. Pretty bad touch. It was really laggy, that's just because we have one of the virtual servers, and my connection is really bad to it. 108 ping. Aw, oh, damn. I really thought Moses had that. I could have cheated up more. Um, I probably shouldn't have went unless I was cheating up more for that. Decent pass out by Moses. I just have to take the 50-50 though. I couldn't beat him to the ball or hit it around him in a decent place. I cheated up there for Timmy's ball. It's pretty clear to me that he's going to hit it downward. Or at least like softly. So I tried to go up for his touch. We ended up uh, getting a goal because of it. There's a decent challenge by me taking him in. And then Moses was able to get, reach it before anyone else. Decent touch by Moses. Timmy, yeah, I was expecting Timmy to hit it out there. Uh, I saw them bump each other behind me, so I had an open goal after hitting it the first time. Uh, right after I got the boom past them, they turned right into each other, and it just gave me free reign for the goal. I didn't even have to rush it. Ball goes wide on my side, but because uh, Moses was cheating, I have to stay back instead of pushing up with them. That's a decent, like, he doesn't really give himself too much room for a pass. 
Then with Timmy on the wall, it should be an easy save for him. I saw the guy wide, so I tried to play it to the wall to give Moses the ball. Fortunately, he could get to it as well. See, Timmy's up, so I have to wait for him. I was expecting him to hit it wide, and I was able to play off of his fairly easily. Moses gets a touch. If the touch went low, I could have went, because it went ho high, Timmy went for the ball instead. I take the 50-50. Timmy might turn to try to pass it middle again, so I'm waiting. Yeah, it goes off the wall, so I'm going to come again. These try to get a pass. I didn't get enough speed on it, so I tried to follow in for a dunk as well. Two people on their team are up, so one of them are most likely going to hit it, so I just waited there. Damn. I tried to pop it and then went out, went out on a 50-50. By popping the ball, I made sure that he had to commit if he wanted to do the 50-50. Oh, that was a really good shot. He barely squeaked it in. I didn't jump early enough to block the angle, though. He had a good first touch and he was able to stay on it. Good placement, though. I have to wait for his touch, but I should be able to get a pretty good, pretty good clue. I was hoping that Timmy would cheat up there for the pass. My pass wasn't really good enough for someone to cheat up on it either way. I hit it too far forward. See, both my teammates are up. I see Timmy's going back, so I can over like, commit a little bit. Oh, that was a pretty good double touch. I think it was going in straight off my touch. It's kind of unlucky that he touched that and didn't save it, honestly. That would have been a really nice save if he got it, though. See, it's going up the wall. Timmy's staying on, so I'm gonna go ahead and back off. I have to wait for thinking up on that. I can't reach his touch, so I'm gonna come back. Timmy's getting the boost in the corner, so I just go straight to goal. Good touch by Moses to clear that out. Moses might hit it across, so I'm staying here again. He actually still might have another. Alright. He loses out on that, so I'm coming back. I see Moses going back for boost now, so I'm coming back up again. Right. I trusted him to win that. I should probably wait for him to touch that as well. But I wanted to try to get a touch to pass it middle. It almost ends up working out as well. Um, a lot of threes is based on rotation, knowing where your teammates are, when to rotate up and when to rotate back. I feel like I've been doing a good job of that right now. We haven't really been double committing for any balls. And if I see that a teammate needs to come back for boost, I'll go up for them. Or I'll even stay back some to let my teammates extend farther. I feel like we've been doing well with that, this, at least this game. I don't really remember the first game that much. But I feel like we did a really good job with that this game. Oh, game 3. Back on this beautiful field. I was gonna say the name of the map, but um, I don't know what map it is. Alright, I saw Moses is cheating up on the right side. He's getting boost and then going for that ball as well. So I waited back a little bit longer to challenge. Timmy should get a touch there, but I didn't really know too much about what he'd be able to do for it, so I waited back for a while. Really good bump by him. I can at least try to play the ball middle for Moses now. It pops out a little bit, but it wasn't quite far enough for Moses to get a shot there. Uh, I was trusting Moses to be able to win that challenge, so I cheated up. Because he didn't, it put Timmy in kind of an awkward situation, but Moses recovered in time to make it fine. But Moses should be able to get a boom on this. I'm going to cheat up and try to at least get a touch middle for him. Uh, because I hit it straight up, I tried to go for a second touch. As the ball was falling right on top of me, so I could have hit it out for someone. I just barely missed. He might hit that out again, so I'm going to wait. That was a good hit out, but Timmy's there, so I have to wait a bit. That was kind of a poor challenge by me. When I saw that Timmy was staying up, I should have gone back myself, instead of staying up there with him. Pretty good touch by Moses. The defender was there, and he was able to get the clear. But he didn't let them really get free possession. You hear they're clustered, so I'm just going to go ahead and charge the ball and hope that I can win out. Almost got it past all of them because of it as well. Uh, I shouldn't have gone for boost in that corner. Uh, the guy on the team that was demoed ended up spawning in that same corner. So there is 
actually like no chance that that boost would be up. I tried to hit the ceiling there so that it went straight down. I knew Moses was pretty close. And even if something didn't happen, when the ball's going straight down, it's hard to get like a big clear on the ball. And Timmy was like pretty clearly in the middle. So I was hoping it would get the one of them eventually. Moses almost scored off of it as well. This is kind of awkward because I popped it up like perfectly on my car. I'm able to hit it out there, Timmy, though. It puts me low at boost. I'm going to come back. They're also both really far up right now. So it's pretty important for me to be at least far enough back on defense to get back in goal if needed. That was a pretty poor touch by me. But he just tries to boom it back, so... I'll win the boom battle every day of the week. Pretty decent shot by Moses, honestly. I have to go early for this bounce out. I was last back, but that was kind of like the only chance I had to clear the ball or get it out of our zone. That was a really good touch by thinking, actually. Timmy's there, so I'm going to go ahead and go up for his three. Try to get it middle for Moses. My ball is almost going in, actually. So this is going in, so I have to play it out myself. Oh, never mind. Cut the tape. Nobody watched that. Thank you. Alright. Moses should have that. I'm gonna go ahead and stay in goal. I don't think Timmy has too much boost, but neither do I. I guess he was trying to fake for me. I get a pretty decent clear there. But um, Timmy is just a little bit slower to the ball than the guy on their team. Fuck Moses. Fuck Moses. Oh, I actually got to that ball as well, he just dunked me. <laughs> That's unfortunate. They're so good. Right, let's see, he's gonna stay on the ball, so I kind of have to go for a dunk in case he does touch it again. Right, that should leave a pretty decent opportunity for either Timmy or Moses. Here, I'm, I kind of just want to get a touch forward again. Oh, a good touch by Moses as well to pop it up. These guys are actually reading stuff off the backboard really early and it makes it much harder to score. I'm a freestyler. That was a really good pass though. He gave me a ton of time and there wasn't really an opportunity for anyone to beat me to that size up so early. And I hit it pretty fast as well. I'm pretty sure someone is going to go for the boost behind me, so I just hit it to the corner. Is Moses actually going to reach that? How did he have that much boost? I actually really didn't think he'd be able to reach that. That was a good shot, though. I should be able to beat him to this. Oh, I got a decent shot on goal as well. But um, nobody on our team can hit the ball, apparently. I was going to try to like take an angled shot there, but Timmy tried to go into a dribble as well. Uh, I'm going to lose this. I realized it too late. Like I heard him jump and then I still went anyway. It's fine though. I'm going to stay a little bit farther back. Timmy's up on the ball and Moses is back as well. But when the ball is played on the wall like that, people usually hit boomers out. So it's much harder to play close there. Yeah, it's gonna bounce mid so I can try to take a shot and not be shit. Thankfully I didn't miss. I actually hit a boomer again though. I think. Maybe not. It wasn't a boomer. I mean, it's not a score. I can't really go for that time would have beat me to the ball. Here, I'm just gonna try to air dribble it out and kill a little bit of time, block any challenge that comes in. It's good that I stayed on it because Vixo didn't have a chance to hit it to our side. I'm staying back now just because I'm low on boost. Try to pick up some pads and maybe cheat up for a ball like. Okay, I can't read a bounce to save my life. That was a good placement by Moses. They just barely saved it. Look! We actually won three games.
Holy shit, did you guys see how fast I was spinning there? The disco. Is this where I do the outro?